what's going on guys? Today we're gonna have a look at yet another Z97 chipset motherboard and this one comes from Gigabyte as well. This is called the Gigabyte Z97X Gaming GT motherboard and of course as the name suggests it is targeted at gamers. Now let's go ahead and take a look. The Gaming GT comes in a huge box which has a lid giving you a peek inside it. It's an interesting packing, well deserved by such a premium motherboard. It comes with a standard manual, an installation guide, a driver CD, 4 SATA cables, an IO shield and one crossfire bridge. Along with this, we have one SLI bridge, a tri SLI bridge and even a 4 SLI bridge. Gigabyte has made sure that it delivers everything in the package, which is a very cool thing as you don't see as many brands doing so much for the consumers. Now taking a look at the motherboard itself, we see that it's in the same red and black matte finish like all of its gaming cousins. The CPU socket which is a LGA 1150 supporting the Haswell, Haswell refresh and even the upcoming Broadwell processors lies safely between these three enormous heat sinks. They are well placed and interconnected via thick aluminium pipes ensuring an optimized cooling experience along with an 8 phase power design. This small one over here houses the PLX chip underneath to which we will come later on. Here. We have the CPU and CPU opt fan con connectors which is something that I personally like simply because of their strategic placement ensuring easy and more aesthetic cable management. Next to it we have the DIMM slots that holds up to 32 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM working at up to 3200 MHz. As you can see they are dyed in two different colors in alternate fashion as they are in dual channel and makes this installation procedure quick and easy for the user. Moving on, the debug 7 segment LED display, the power button, reset button and CMOS cleaner buttons lies next to the dim slots and also have physical voltage read points making the gaming GT an ideal choice for overclockers and test bench setups. On the side we have the OC PEG port which is an external power connector for enhanced PCIe stability especially in cases where you use high power GPUs. From the storage point of view the gaming GT has 6 SATA 3 ports for 6 GB per second and 2 SATA express ports for a speed of up to 10 GB per second. They make it a total of 8 SATA ports which is ample of connectivity options. The famous chunky red color I logo of the chipset heatsink rests right next to it. The bottom end houses two more fan connectors and dual BIOS switches to help you choose between the two BIOS mostly in cases if you mess up things. Coming to the highlight of the Gigabyte Z97X Gaming GT, we have four PCIe 3 lanes the first one and the third ones are PCIe 3 x16 ports whereas the second and fourth are PCIe 3 x8 ports followed by three legacy PCIe 2.0 ports. Amongst the distinguishing features is the amp up enhanced audio support which is something from gigabyte previous generations. Strategically, the chip is isolated from rest of the components to solve the problem of static distortion, enhancing the performance of the gold capacitor's manifold. Gigabyte uses a Realtek ALC1150 chip to control audio and power high-end speakers and headphones, giving an immersive experience. Here we have the much-talked-about swappable op-amp feature and chip. You can control the power delivered by the audio jacks through these dip switches for better hearing experience especially for high power headphones the IO port is something that Gigabyte has stuffed with features as well. First up we have the DAC up USB 2.0 ports painted yellow. These basically convert signals from digital to analog. 
It's a desirable feature if you connect devices like cell phones or iPods to your computer as they withdraw power from the system and you need ripple free power delivery for optimum performance. Below we have a PS2 port and a VGA port. A DVI port stacked up next to them is an option optical out, a HDMI port and a display out port followed by four USB 3.0 ports and the killer E2200 Ethernet port with two more USB 3.0 ports. Last but not the least six audio jacks which are also gold plated for optimum performance. So guys that concludes my overview and unboxing of the Gigabyte Z97X Gaming GT motherboard. Do read the full review on the blog, the link is in the description below. And if you like our video, then do like and share.